Uh, I'm, uh, my name is James Ho. I uh, was uh, born and raised in Singapore. I uh, spent the past 27 years in the U.S. Uh, so I, I still practice over there, uh, but uh, I'm happy to have the opportunity to uh, you know, come back to Singapore to practice as well um, since about three years ago. So um, here I am trying to bring some of the skills and knowledge that I learned overseas uh, back to serve my fellow countrymen. I've been see treating Invisalign patients since uh, 2004 in the US, so that would make me uh, almost nine and a half, ten year veteran in using this technology. And uh, at the beginning, I was very conservative. I treat uh, the cases that are most predictable uh, because there has been always rumors out there uh, that says uh, Invisalign is weaker than the traditional bases and this and that. But uh, over the years, I've uh, come to learn that uh, Invisalign is a very powerful technology. In fact, uh, there are cases where I don't feel comfortable treating with uh, regular braces that I use Invisalign to treat, especially cases that involves um, where uh, I need to make a, a skip um, where the, the, the cover of the Invisalign can uh, allow the skip to happen. So uh, as you might have imagined, I would treat um, any, uh, all the cases from uh, class two, three, and the normal crowding cases, extraction without extraction cases. So uh, basically, I try not to say no to patients when they ask for Invisalign. And uh, then the challenge becomes how to uh, get around the usual using the best uh, the technology has to offer. Well, uh, in Singapore, I must uh, say that I was uh, pleasantly surprised uh, that uh, there are many patients who um, come to me uh, because of the Invisalign brand name recognition uh, that uh, they would seek dental treatment for the first time in years. Uh, normally, I would expect people who have been under um, you know, regular dental care upon suggestions of the dentist, they would say, okay, uh, let's do something about the crooked teeth and stuff. But uh, um, the surprise element was when they just came to me and say that uh, they want treatment because Invisalign is, uh, they have friends or family or they heard about uh, Invisalign and that's been, um, you know, uh, it's because of the various advantages it offers. So uh, they come to me and from that point, I was able to help my patients by, you know, um, bringing them awareness of uh, regular oral hygiene and other dental needs that, that they may have. Uh, because as you know, all Invisalign patients has to be qualified uh, before we can just say, okay, let's take the impression. In fact, that's usually the uh, last thing that we do after all the uh, dental needs have been taken care of. But uh, having said that, uh, most patients are um, in Singapore are um, quite uh, receptive to uh, my recommendations, and I'm happy to, to be able to help them along uh, their dental care and dental needs in addition to uh, giving them a beautiful smile. Like I said before, uh, Sing uh, the patients in Singapore, some of them, they would come to me uh, you know, as the first point of contact after many years of uh, absence from the dental office. Uh, but in the US, uh, most of the patients who, are, um, who have been my, my pa under my care, um, they would come to me uh, because uh, they would do, uh, do Invisalign because uh, of, um, you know, um, I brought to their awareness how Invisalign can help them. So uh, this is the main difference. But uh, having said that, uh, I like to say that uh, it is my ultimate goal to treat all patients the same way to um, you know, uh, the same exact high standards I set for myself.